Hi there, welcome back. This is Manoya. Today's idiom is make hay while the sun shines. Actually, this isn't an idiom, it's a proverb. Now, at the end, I'm also going to tell you something about this poet called Robert Herricks. He has written a poem in which there's one line that I love Gather ye rosebuds while ye may. He wrote it in conjunction with marriage, but I'm going to give you a more practical use of this line. Watch till the end. Uh, what it means is when you have an opportunity to do something, do it. Grab the opportunity while it's available and get your things done. Don't lose that opportunity, that chance. Now, let's look at a bit about the origin of this so that you'll know what it actually means. See, hay is when plants like oat, barley, wheat, etc. are harvested and the green remains of that, they are processed into hay. You have to, you know, cut and rake and ted and bale them into hay. That's a long process and for that you need to have sun. And in the English-speaking countries, especially in the places where this originated, this proverb, the number of sunny days is very less, few and far between. So the moment they see the sun, hey, come, let's make hay. Otherwise, their animals will go hungry. Hay is a fodder for animals. So you make hay while the sun shine, shines means when you have the opportunity, when the sun is shining, do your job, make the hay so that your animals don't go hungry. They also make straw for bed, as the olden days, of course. But yeah. So figuratively, what this means is you have an opportunity. The sun is shining. That's an opportunity for you. Make hay. Do what you're supposed to do, like make money or whatever. Let's look at them in a few sentences to see how they work practically. He's just 26 but he's working for 18 hours a day. He says he's just making hay while the sun shines. He's slow down when he's, once he's made enough money. He will slow down later. Another one. The tourism industry in the hilly areas, the mountainous regions, you know like Shimla, Nanital, Missouri, etc. is seasonal. So we have tourists coming in in the summers and in winters you have snow etc. Not a lot of tourists go there unless you love snow. So during the summer months the tourism industry makes hay but that is when the sun shines. So what are you doing? Why are you going to Shimla now? Why am I going to make hay? Make hay? Yeah, it's March already. I go there, make some preparations and wait for the tourists to come. I'll make some money then. I'll make hay while the sun shines in the summer months. Here's a very bad piece of news that we've heard in Delhi. People were selling oxygen cylinders and oxygen concentrators and remdesivir, etc. All these COVID medicines in the black market. They were selling it for exorbitant sums. They know that people will buy whatever you charge them. So they were out to make hay while the sun shone. Really sad, isn't it? Hey, where is humanity? You are selling things at exorbitant prices, knowing fully well that they're going to hurt the people. People are losing their kith and kin and they are spending all their money they have trying to save them. And here you're trying to make money out of them, fleecing them, bleeding them. Making hay while sun shines, yeah. Inhuman. Let's look at one, a very pleasant thing as well. Now we've got a long weekend, so let's make hay while the sun shines. We clean up the backyard. Yeah, my backyard also needs a lot of cleaning. Gotta do it. Now, there is one other, let's call it a line. A poet called Robert Herrick in one of his poems 
has said this, which is related to this problem. Gather ye rosebuds while ye may. Now what Robert Herrick said in his poem is asking the women, the girls, to get married while they are still young because once they grow old, nobody's going to marry them. I think that's really crass, boorish, but okay, I won't say anything more about that. But what it, how the way it's related to this idiom is, you know, gather ye rosebuds while ye may, I think it's very beautifully stated. While ye may, means when you have the advantage with you, that is when you may, gather the rosebuds, get your things done. So while you're still alive, do some things worthwhile that will make your life worth it. Gather your rosebuds while you may. Look, the, market, the, the, the share market is actually rising because the company has just given a lot of dividends. So sell your shares, make some profits, gather your rosebuds while you may. Look, the opposite team has got a lot of injuries. So we've got to take advantage of that and win the next match. Gather ye rosebuds while ye may. Make hay while the sun shines. Same thing. Here's another one. Uh, somebody is working in a company and he's saying, all right, let me go to a foreign country where I should normally get a better pay, etc. And then the company said, look, we've got a huge contract and we have to work overtime to finish it. I'm going to double your pay. And I'm also going to give you a car. It's going to be a company car. Transferred to you. It's going to be yours completely with driver. So gather your rosebuds while you may. I'm not going abroad. I'm going to stay and work in the same company now. Gather your rosebuds while you may. I'm going to make some extra money here. Work overtime. Work extra. Get my car and show for an extra pay. That's the rosebuds. And I'm going to gather them while I may. The company is giving it to me. So, yeah, these two are parallel idioms, if you please. Thank you for watching this video, liking it, and subscribing to our channel. We'll see you in the next video. Until then.